Okay, friends, let's take a look at finding the domain of, say, f of x, y, and let's define it as 1 over x minus y. It's a function of two variables. x is one variable, y is another variable. Nevertheless, the basic condition to be applied always is the same. That is, x, in this case, minus y, cannot be equal to 0 because we do not divide by 0. That always is true. So then specifically, just add y to both sides, which allows us to say that x cannot be equal to y. And that's one way to describing it. You can also do it in set builder notation. So let's do it over here in set builder notation. A curly brace, x comma y, that's the object, and then the predicate, which is usually followed after a colon or a vertical line. And the predicate is just a truth condition. So we're going to say, oops, not equal to y. And then you terminate with a matching curly brace. That's a set builder form. You can also say it in a nice way, elegant, beautiful way which is you can say it's all of R2, so all of the basic two-dimensional space, and then take away from it all the points that are on the line. So it's R2 minus the set of all x comma y, such that with the colon or a vertical line, if you like, and then x is equal to y, and then terminate with a matching curly brace. These things are like this here, right, this, they're all equivalent. They all essentially express the same logic. In terms of a picture, sometimes you're asked for that. So you can do that here. Just draw a plane and the line x is not equal to y. Well, draw the line x does equal y instead. And then our domain would be everything not on the line. So we usually indicate it by taking this line and then dashing it. And then in terms of shading, you would just shade everything off the line like this, you see? So all this would be part of the domain, everything under the line would be part of the domain, but anything on the line would not be part of the domain. So the line would be excluded, therefore it has to be dashed. Please leave a like and subscribe if you like math videos at this more advanced level.